Hello everyone, my name is Brutal. I have returned, as you can imagine, based on who you see in front of you today, right here, right now, I am back with Callie Carrot. We are ready to rock and roll. We have just taken a lovely trip from Orkhamar down here to Tenaris to start our Oldham adventure. And here we have Mr. Kevin. He's probably going to, uh... Immortalize himself by killing us. That's okay. We're, we're gonna we're gonna trust Kevin. Have I have I mentioned how much I love the Death Knight class? Have I mentioned? Oh, it's Sock. Oh, it's my buddy Sock. I didn't know you had a Cuban Death Knight. All right, so we're starting our adventure in Oldham today. We are level 83. We're gonna be we're gonna be <clears throat> venturing into level 84 territory. Are you ready, Kelly Kara? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. So what I'm gonna go ahead and you? turn in this quest. We're gonna escort this caravan. Are you ready? Okay. Come click on uh, Lady Humps over here, the camel. Nice. I like it. Yeah, we're clicking on Lady Humps, everyone. Okay, little cut scene action. I'm ready to rock and roll. Thank you all for joining us today. If you're watching live on Twitch, if you're watching this on the YouTubes, happy you're here. Callie Care and I, we, uh, we're, we're, we're close. You know, we are so close to max, max level, current max level, which is level 100. You know what's nuts? When you and I started this adventure, like, 18 years ago, the maximum level in World of Warcraft at that time was level 90. It is now level 100, and by the time by the time we reach level 100, Ahoy. it may be 110 for all we know. Maybe Legion will be out by the time we actually finish. We're, we'll find out. But I, I have faith. I think we will reach level 100 before Legion launches. If we can, if we can keep getting, like, a level every week or when so. When does Legion launch? The latest it'll, it'll launch is September. The latest mm. it'll launch. Mm. All right, I don't know. <laughs> now, now let's let's not worry about that. Now, now let me let me break it down for you, okay? We are currently in a zone called Oldham. All right, I'm not sure, I'm not sure why we're staring at the statue for so long. I see a bird flying in the sky. Now, listen, Kelly Kara, we've had our differences, okay? We have we have argued: should we dungeon? Should we quest? Should you play a monk, or should you play any other class in the game? Should you eat while we're streaming, or should you not? We have selected to eat. But the point is, the point is, let me break it down for you. This zone that we are heading into right now is arguably one of the most beautiful zones in the entire game. From an aesthetic standpoint, the way it looks, just the way it unfolds, it is gorgeous. I don't know why this is... I'm gonna I'm gonna cancel the cinematic. I suggest you do the same. I think it might be bugged. Hit Great. escape. Hit just hit escape on your keyboard and say yes. I do want to cancel the cinematic. But the point is, it is arguably one of the best looking zones in the entire game, and I, I will prove that to you. Hey, time flies when you're having fun. I've earned exalted with uh, the guild. Look at that. Oh, look at that. We're both exalted with the guild. Oh my goodness. <laughs> hey, it's Kevin. What's up, Kevin? But I think this zone is absolutely gorgeous. It is beautiful. Oh, oh God, look at Oh, what? Kevin, what are you doing? What's going on here? Okay, um, but man, it's, it's, a, it's a beautiful zone. We're going to go ahead and pick up this quest over here from Prince Nadoon. So make sure you do that. Thank you, dear. Thank you, dear. And we are going to go uncover Nephrosit's... Nefer... Nefersets, we're going to say Neferset. that's going to be the, the name, is Nefersets Secret, okay? Okay. Something like that. I don't remember how to do this exactly, so I think you have to go up here and click this plant or stand by this plant, this potted plant or something. Nope, maybe. I forget. Oh, you just did something. Apparently you know what you're doing, but I don't. <laughs> nope, okay, nope, still nothing on my end. Okay, maybe man, let's 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 go for a redo here. Let's do a little redo. We'll walk back here. We'll walk up. Oh, oh here now I can eating. now I can click it. That's weird. Couldn't <laughs> click it beforehand. I'm sorry. What what you what was the question? I'm watching the genie. Yes, watch the genie. Please observe the genie. Can't hear anything. Oh wait, I, I have to anything. actually watch the stupid cinematic for it to give me credit. I forgot. Okay, give me just a minute. Give me just a minute. <clears throat> hey, Goreblade, what's up, man? Demelis says hashtag Team Kevin. <laughs> hey, Inlara, how are you, buddy? So, essentially, what's going on right here is uh, Deathwing has bestowed pa 
power upon these d d d jars, or however you pronounce the word, I don't remember exactly. And uh, they're trying to build an army for Deathwing, but we're not going to allow that to happen. Hop on, let's rock and roll. Whee! We're going to go turn in the quest over here. Oh, Prince Nadun, Nadin, let me know when you're ready. Ready. Okay, oh, should he's be... chained to a wall. I didn't really. Yeah, yeah, he's 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 chained up. He's a good guy, but these uh, these bad guys have chained him up. There should be a quest from Bud in the cage. Okay, I got you that. Got one. that? You're good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, thank you, thank you. So what we're gonna do right here? We're just gonna go around. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna show these guys who's boss. All right, we're gonna show them who's boss. We're gonna take care of business. We, uh, oh, there's something over here that we can click. Looks like there's some armor we have to collect. See this armor right here? There's armor all over the place. Go ahead and claim the sentinel here. By the way, for those watching this live or on YouTube, I have increased the volume of the music, the like the zone music, the game music. If it's too loud, I apologize. I will... Do my best to, to pay attention to make sure it doesn't get out of hand, but it may be loud compared to... Let me turn up my... I'm going to turn up my microphone just a little bit. I'll try not to yell too often. All right, Callie. Oh, Skada. That's great. Good job. Oh, it looks like I have disabled Skada. Oh, no. I have disabled Skada. I'm going to go ahead and reload my UI while you kill off this bad guy. Got to make sure we have Skada enabled to ensure that we see how much damage old Callie Kara is capable of producing. Sorry, I not I, missing anything. Oh, um, you know what? Have faith in yourself. Three, four. Have you been drinking today? Two. No. <sighs> no, not, not with all the exercising I have to do. <laughs> well, you know there was hope, but oh well. <laughs> oh well. All right, I've grabbed some armor. Oh, this guy's back up uh, already. Good grief. That was a quick respawn. <clears throat> oh, yeah, we'll talking. kill him again. Whatever. We'll kill him again. Why not? Right. All right. We'll just take him out. Hey, whoa! Someone's doing some damage. That's what I'm talking about. That was some hot stuff there, Cali Kara. That was some now that hot I know where my buttons stuff. are. She knows where her buttons are. She knows where her buttons are. <laughs> All right, we'll go ahead and take out this Sentinel. Vox says everything is just fine in terms of the audio. Good, good. I have collected almost all the armor. Now I think we need to throw some uh, brazier torches on this hay. There should be some hay here. There we go. That is that is pronounced brazier, by the way. Not brazier. It's <laughs> brazier. There's some armor to collect over here. Just like just like when when in the when, there okay, so there are there are abilities on bosses in this game. Uh, like a flame buffet. It's not a flame buffet. It's called buffet. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Buffet is where you go and you eat many, many things until you're completely overly full. Buffets are not abilities that bosses have in this game, unless they are literally throwing food at you. <laughs> that actually is, that, that does occur in Legion. There is a boss uh, in the, the Nighthold raid in Legion. He spawns cakes, and you have to consume cakes. But we're not talking about that. We're talking about buffets. That's you are really being funny. buffeted, all right? That's very funny. Just, just keep that in mind. Luke. <clears throat> keep that in mind. All right, we are working our way towards some uh, barrels and bales of hay. Not barrels, but bales, I guess. Bales of hay. Uh, I'm not sure where they would be. Oh, there's one over there in the corner. You see that uh, bale of hay over there in the corner? Why don't you go light that bad boy? I'll, I'll take care of this denizen here. I don't know what I, I don't. I have no idea what you just asked me. So, to do. back to your right, there is a bale, a, a little like rectangle of hay. You have a torch in your quest log on the right side of your screen. If you walk over to that hay and click that torch, it'll light the hay on fire and it'll, it'll give, uh, give us credit for that quest. Right oh, here. Oh, there's the hay. Right oh, here. Okay. Oh, let, me put a, let me put a marker on our head. That would be important, wouldn't it? Here, right, markers so on the head. Markers this. on the head. There you go. Bale of hay burnt four out of five. And there's one more <laughs> right here. Come take care of this it's bad boy there. right here. Yep, yeah, right here behind me. There you All go. Right. All right. Thank you, dear. And... Right. Hey, well, we're welcome back. On this, jump on, yep, jump on the old mount, mount the okay. do. There we go. We should have all three requests are ready to turn in, right? 
I always find it hilarious on my end to where your little spaceship isn't there and it's just <laughs> us flying through the air. <laughs> it just hasn't rendered properly. <laughs> oh, oh wow, someone's dying. Oh wow, someone's got wrecked. That was not us. For the record, we did not just slay that young man. I feel bad for him. Okay, make sure you turn in. Ooh, okay, there is, um, there is, you're a monk. Okay, so none of the items for the Cavum, the Callus quest are an upgrade, just so you know. Okay. None are an upgrade. Did you turn in all three quests? I think so. Okay. Add a dawn. Good day to you. Looks like there is a uh, there's a cinematic here. Now, when the cinematic finishes, you should spawn in a new area of the game. Let Where'd me know you when you're go? here. What are you talking about? Did you turn in all three quests? Yeah. Yeah. It says escape from the lost city. Oh, okay. So, you, wh where are you? By the prince. Where'd you go? Uh, <laughs> I mean, when when the movie... Did a movie start playing? No. Talk to the prince. Does the prince have anything to say? What about Bud? Did you turn in your quest to Bud? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, boy. You're... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, it says, um... I got the fate of something ready for turn in. The fate of something? The fate of the Ruby Dragonshire. What the heck? Is that from, like, Dragon Blind or something? Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you hit L, under which cat uh, category is that quest under? Like, is that under Battle Pets? Peak of Serenity? Oldham? Another quest in another <clears throat> area altogether? Oh, look at that. It changes. Those are off. Okay, so that says Dragon Blight. Yeah, you can you can abandon that quest. I thought I got rid of all this stuff. Well, apparently you didn't. I have returned to save you. Hello. Welcome. All right, now okay. Now, as I was saying, this zone, un. Deniably, one of the one of the most beautiful zones in the game. I'm gonna take us way up, and I promise I'm not actually doing this to drop because we discovered last time you you know you, you have a parachute, blah blah blah. I don't know yeah, how far work. I don't know how far your laptop allows you to see. I don't know if you, can you see the statues to our right and to our left. No, just to the right. Oh, all right, well, never mind. Uh, you, apparently, you can't see the uh, the same rendering distance that I can. But this zone is absolutely. It is absolutely beautiful. I wish you could see what I see. It is just... It is gorgeous. I think this is... Again, I would love to know in the comments whether you're watching this live or on YouTube. Do you agree? Do you disagree? Do you think Oldham is gorgeous like I do? Do you think another zone... I, I'm not saying Oldham is the best looking zone in the game, but it's one of the best look. I mean, look at this. It's just... It's beautiful. <clears throat> it's absolutely beautiful. It's incredible to me. I mean, this is just a, you know, just a portion of the zone. But anyway, yeah, I'm a big fan of the zone. There's a temple over there. Little little pyramid. Oh, man, love it. Yes, heels. Heels agrees. Yes. Were they trying to make this place look like um, Babylon? Uh, probably a little bit of Egypt. Or like little bit, ancient little bit of, Egypt Yeah, yeah ancient Egypt, a little bit of Babylon. Ba Babylon. Listen to Babylon, yeah. But just, just a beautiful zone. Beautiful zone. Okay, you have a quest to turn into this guy, correct? <clears throat> yeah. All right. Uh, I would recommend taking the gold because we don't really care about the the um, reputation at this point in time. So take, take <laughs> I don't that need gold. the valor. The, the what? It says I can have a royal reward or valor. Take 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 the gold. Like select the gold pieces. Should be the option on the left. I mean, it's literally just, it looks like gold. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Take the gold. I like badges. Well, you know, you can get that later. When you uh, when you're done with that, we're gonna walk back outside over here. We'll go ahead and mount back up, and we're gonna take this flight path right here, just for the sake of obtaining it. There we go. Click that flight path guy. Kurzel is her name. Okay. All right, and we are on our way to begin our questing experience. How far into level 83 are you? You should be around 20%. 
19. Ah, perfect. That's 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 just about as good as it gets. Okay. All right. Here is the Sun Priest Aceris. We're gonna go ahead and take his two quests. All right. Okay. And then we're gonna click on him again, and we're gonna we're gonna click the I might be able to help. More than a uh, Neferset behind this option, because that's gonna give you credit toward a quest. Uh, okay. You have spoken to him. Congratulations. <coughs> Congratulations. Now down here, we need to collect some relics of the Sun King. So we're gonna fight guys on camels. This is one of the first representations of mounted combat out in the world, but sadly we have still yet to receive mounted combat, unless you count and uh, consider the Paladin talent from the uh, upcoming expansion, Legion. I forget what it's called, but there's a there's a talent to where four seconds you get, I think it's 100% increased run speed, and you can attack while you're on a mount. It's pretty cool. But still to this day, we cannot attack or combat people on mounts. It's, it's a sad day for World of Warcraft players. A sad day. But anyway, we're trying to collect these relics of the Sun King from these guys. We should have two at this point in time. Should have two. We also... Oh, that's right. We need to drain some venom from these scorpids. Okay, so we need to... We're going to kill a scorpid here. And then we're going to drain the venom from these scorpids, okay? So you need, to, you need to click the corpse. And then click the antidote vial on the right side of your screen to drain the venom blood. Okay. Okay, so it looks like we need to kill 16 of those stupid things because only one of us can obtain the Venom Blood. Are you serious? From a, yeah, we need to kill 16 of those bad boys. That's okay. It just means, hey, you're the one that wants a quest, all right? I don't want to hear it. <laughs> I just want to hear it. Oh, hey, Mike, what's up, man? Oh, yes. Adadon says that he, he or she, I'm sorry, I think it's a he, but Adadon says they love the history of the zone and how it looks like a bit of ancient Egypt. And they do agree that it is a beautiful zone. Well said, and I agree wholeheartedly. Adadon, love it, love it, love it. Goreblade says this zone is beautiful. If you like sand, sand, and even more sand, which I guess is appropriate, considering we are standing on sand, with sand being blown in their eyes. Where are you going? Where are you going? I'll go ahead and take the venom blood from this guy. And I will be making our way or my way to another camel. Waste Wander Outrider right here. Killing him. Let's see. Dysentery says, Oldham is awesome looking. Vashir. Vashir, okay. As, as much as I dislike questing, questing, questing in Vashir because of the fact that it is an underwater zone. It is a beautiful zone. No doubt about that. Absolutely. Absolutely. Let's see. Puddin Kitty says that she, he or she... Oh, I see how it is. You just want to go do your own thing. Okay, I see how it is. You're not see how it is. me? What? You follow me, not the other way around? <laughs> Who do you think you are? <laughs> I thought you were coming to get this scorpion. I'm crying out loud. We'll make sure you take the venom blood. There you go. <laughs> Alright, I'm going, I'm going to go over to this one right over here. Mm. <laughs> I always get to listen to you yell at me twice because of my fault. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. It is true. That is true. Ooh, Might says he is playing some Warcraft 3, another great game, which, by the way, I purchased uh, I purchased Warcraft 3 for Waxart, our little sister, for her to play and enjoy at her leisure. Maybe I'll do the same thing for you for uh, for an upcoming yes, uh, like celebration or, or holiday or event or something like that. It's okay. It is... Warcraft 3 is the third in a series of Real, um, real-time strategy games, or RTSs as they're called, and you uh, you actually take on the persona of numerous characters in the Warcraft universe, such as Thrall and many, many others, and you learn about how this world of Warcraft was shaped and prepared for us. It's a lot. It's a lot of fun. It's one of the one of the best games Blizzard's ever made. Interesting. Out. Yep. But maybe I'll get that for you one day. Maybe. Okay. Hey, Miss Pamela, what's going on, girl? How are you? How are you? Oh, look out! It's Dante. There we go. It's Dante. Hey, attack. are you familiar with the Dark Souls series? No. You don't know what Dark Souls is. Okay. Well, Dark Souls Three releases this uh, in a few days, this coming week, and Dante, the gentleman who just fell from the sky, 
who was also Kevin the Death Knight a few minutes ago, if you recall. Yes. That gentleman uh, has been a long-time viewer. He's one of the moderators of the channel. He's a great guy. He is well-loved and well-received on in our community. He, he took it upon himself to make sure that I had a copy of Dark Souls 3. He purchased a copy of the game and gifted it to me on Steam. So, Dante, of course, I can only assume you're listening. Thank you again, Dante, for gifting the copy of the game. We will be playing it on the channel for, in the, uh, for the weeks to come when I'm not raid testing or raiding in the World of Warcraft. So if you guys like the Dark Souls series, which I can only hope some of you do, but it's, it's, it's one of the greatest series made out there. It's just it's so much fun. Essentially, it's you battling a bunch of bosses. It's just it's fun. And they're very difficult bosses. It is not an easy game. It is incredibly unforgiving. But old Dante... Oh, look out. It's Neek, Savior of Azeroth. Okay, he's flying away. We're good. We're good. But Dante... Dante heard I didn't have any intention of buying the game because I don't like spending money on video games, which sounds silly, but it's true. That's why I normally only play World of Warcraft. But he's like, nope, not going to do. So he bought me the game, and I'm, I'm rip-roaring ready to go. I'm ready to go, baby. <laughs> ready to go. I can't believe you've never heard of Dark Souls. It's it's an incredibly fun game. Incredibly fun game. How many Venom Blood Scorpions have, uh, Scorpions have you drained? I just need one more. One more! That's okay. Oh, look out, it's Neek. He's probably gonna kill us. Look out, it's Neek! He's going for it! Save me, Dante! Save me! <laughs> Get out of here, Neek! <laughs> this, this questing is so dangerous. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Good grief. Uh, let's see, what else is going on? Miss Killian, hello? Itakin, hello? Is that your last one you got there? Yeah. Okay, oh, we don't need any more of the camel guys, so go ahead and jump on. We're just gonna go, I need four more of the Venom Blood guys. Okay. We're just gonna, we're just gonna fly around, and we're gonna look for the Venom Bloods. Here's one. Here we go. Uh, I think Dark Souls 3 came out a couple weeks ago for console gamers, but they didn't come out for um, it didn't come out for PC or it isn't coming out for PC until this week if I'm not mistaken. Uh, Miss Pamela says that she just has uh, she has returned from a family gathering, and now she's going to be doing some garrison stuff. Now, Callie Care, correct me if I'm wrong, but speaking of family gathering, the next time that you and I will see each other face to face is upon my son's birth. Is that correct? And uh, uh, sometime. I was hoping June. June. What's in June? Am I forgetting something? Oh, yeah. <laughs> we're going on vacation together. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, it was kind of your request. <laughs> it's your vacation. <laughs> you. <laughs> Okay, I sit corrected. The next time you and I will actually <laughs> see each other is in June. We're, it was we're, a big deal. We're, <laughs> we are going on a family vacation. That'll be fun. <laughs> but after that, are you still planning on coming down for, the, for my boy's birth? Yes, oh, I am planning on coming is, down oh, for that. That's going to be so cool. Now, that's, you know, hopefully sometime in August, if all goes according to plan. <laughs> um... After that, are you coming down for any other family functions this year? Maybe the the annual get together around Thanksgiving? No. Okay, so we get to go. what? At least I get to see you a couple times this year. This is true. This is true. I'm looking forward to it. It's that's more than your average, uh, the the average time that I get to see you, which is yeah. Nice. Normally it's once, once a, year. a year. Yeah. So it's I get to see you twice as many times this year. I know. Very excited about that. Mm -hmm. Oh, we do have a quest to turn in here. Okay, it looks like you are going to be able to select an item. Now, that belt may be an upgrade for you. Let's find out. Let's find out. Um, I, I need agility, right? Leather agility, yes. That, okay. I would say it's an upgrade. I would take that bad boy and slap it on. Okay. I would take it and slap it on. Where is the belt? Somewhere in your bag. I'm going to sit still. You take care of you. Equip that bad boy. All right, it's on. You, all right, good deal. I like it. I like it. Let's flip around here. And we're going to fly northwest. I can't believe I forgot about our vacation. About June? I feel like that an was idiot. hilarious. <laughs> feel like an idiot. It's okay, though. We're, we're in this to win this. No big deal. 
Good to know that some people are uh, have been watching this series in its entirety because we have people saying equip belt in chat right now. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> That's hilarious. Equip belt. Uh oh, <laughs> what is that? Dante, what? Snake and Dante killing this guy. All right, hop on. Let's go. That's really funny. It is funny. I agree. We are heading back southeast now. We were going northwest. Now we're going southeast. <laughs> All right. I still remember that face I gave you. I'm like, this isn't going to work. He's embarrassing me. <laughs> it's not going to do it. <laughs> Time out. Time out. Wait. Pause. Hold the phone. Are you eating sea salt caramel delicious ice cream? Yes. Yes. That is the best ice cream in the world. I know. I it's love fine. that ice cream. That's why I didn't stop when you Oh asked my you. god! <laughs> it all makes sense now! No I'm wonder like, you're no, eating it. I'm eating my ice oh cream. Oh my goodness, that ice cream. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I don't know if those wrists are an upgrade. Wait, let's let's check out your wrists real quick. Yes! Sidian, that brand is delicious. 16 agility, <laughs> haste mastery. Nah, it's there's no real upgrade for you here, just so you know. So don't worry about it. Yeah, guys, I, for those of you that... Okay, now, 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 disclaimer, okay? That ice cream, 100% honest with you guys here, not the cheapest ice cream out there. It's like five, at least down here in Florida, it's like $5.79 for that little tiny container. But I swear to you guys, I swear, it is amazing. It is so good. It is worth the $5.79. My wife loves that ice cream. It, it, we, when we go shopping at Publix, it is it is buy one, get one free once every like six weeks. And every time it's BOGO, we will grab a couple. That way it makes us feel better about buying it. But even then, every once in a while, we'll pay full price for that for that thing. It is so good and it is so worth it. What brand is that? Talenti. Can you hold it up for the, to the camera real quick? Talenti? Yeah. Oh my God! It is it is unbelievable. <laughs> it is unbelievable. Make sure. Did you t pick up this quest? I'm sorry. I'm kind of just. I did. Flapping my lips over here. <laughs> okay, we need to, um, Good day to you. investigate you around. something or another. Oh, make sure you talk to uh, a sock here. The guy on the right with the weird-looking guy with the helmet on. We need to speak to a sock. So make sure you do that. Okay. Speak I to did it now. a sock. Get it? A sock. <laughs> sock, you're the best. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I am freaking out. That ice cream is so good. Please, everyone, go buy. Go buy it. Set aside a couple of bucks. It's well it's sponsored. Listen, I'm not sponsored by this weird... Re that'd be weird. Brutal Static sponsored by Talanti. That'd be kind of cool, but no. I mean, listen. <laughs> I, I gain nothing by telling you to go do this other than the fact that you will return to the channel sometime in the near future, and you will say, My God, you're right. All right, pick up this quest and talk to this guy again. King Farius sent me, blah, blah, blah. Make sure you speak with Namark Tenneth. Sellout mode engaged. Plot twist, brutal works for Talenti. <laughs> <laughs> I wish, man, I'd have all the, I'd be, whew, I'd be fatter than I currently am. Speaking of, by the way, speaking of, oh my, wait, what am I doing here? Forget. Oh, my wife says she's not feeling well. She's got a text. Okay, I need to. Oh, is that what that song was? Yeah, that was that was that's called a text message. <laughs> yeah. Did you get credit for two out of thirty of the thieving pluckers smashed? Yeah. Okay. There's there's a hammer on the right side of your screen that you just need to run around and click a bunch. Apparently, this person's way faster than I am, and they are getting credit for. It. Anyway, speaking of being fat and losing weight. Uh, I texted our mother yesterday. Um, she is coming home in mid-May to help us begin our baby registry. Uh, man, will this per I swear to God, can we not just please pick different routes? It's not that hard. Um, she's coming down in mid-May. She's going to be helping us register for our baby registry. And we're just going to have some fun with it and whatnot. And she and I are both looking to lose some weight before the little guy's born. What are you doing? Why? What are you doing? I'm alting. There's a whole bunch of red things on my thing. So <laughs> oh, we're done. We're done here. We're done here. We're done here. Get on. Get on. Get I on. don't know where you are. Get in. I'm right. I'm literally right here. Stop moving. I'm right here. Oh, get there on. you are. Okay. But we both want to lose some weight by the time the little guy's born. Turn in this quest, please. 
Let me know when you're good. Yeah, I guess I'm ready. What? I mean, did you turn in the quest? Yeah. What do you mean, yeah? Ha has it says take it to him and impending retribution. Okay, cool. That's what we need, yeah. But anyway, yeah, we both want to lose some weight before little Isaac's born. So I texted her yesterday. I'm like, yo, Ma, listen. I want to lose some weight. You want to lose some weight. Let's make let's make a bet. So we are we're both looking to lose about ten pounds over the next thirty five days or so, completely within the realm of possibilities. Because you know I'm I'm uh, I want to be under two hundred pounds at or under two hundred pounds I should say by the time Isaac's born. Turn in this quest. Pick up the new one. Let me make sure you're good. Or let me know when you're good. I should say. I'm good. Okay, let's walk outside. And the bet has been made. So we're both going to weigh in the day she arrives, which is like May 13th or something like that. And if I am at my goal of two, I want to be 220 by the time she gets here, okay? So I want to be 220 by the time she gets here. I'm, 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 I'm like 233 or something like that right now. If I'm 220 when she gets here and she is not at her goal weight of whatever she set, then, then she takes... Amanda and I out on a little date. And that date will be the new Captain America movie, which comes out in um, early May. If I don't meet my goal, but she does, then um, then I take her out on the date, because she likes the Marvel movies. Turn in this quest, pick up the new one. Let me know when you're mm -hmm, good. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, there should be a little bomb here I'm gonna click. You getting a cutscene? Yeah. So I take her on a date. If we have both met our goal, then we'll probably do something to something terrible like eat out or something like that. But, but the point <laughs> is, it's, it's a lot of fun. It's helping us, you know. It's holding, we're holding each other accountable. We're you know working toward a great a great thing. You know, we we want to be a little bit healthier for. I, oh wow, Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. Anyone? <laughs> oh my goodness! Give me a break. Is failure not an option? For the oh, like if we if neither one of us reach our goal, well if neither one of us reach our goal, then shame on us. <laughs> but um, I'm sure one of at least one of us, if not both of us, will reach our goal. Okay. Did you see how you jumped in a chest and you got blown away, kind of like Kingdom of the Crystal, Crystal Skull? The, yeah, the that was movie. cute. Yeah. The mu the movie wasn't, but you know whatever. Yeah, that poor movie. Yeah. You know they're making another one. No, I didn't know that actually. They are making a was it a, a fifth Harrison Jones. Indiana Jones movie. Wait, Harrison. I'm said Harrison Jones because that's the character's name. Harrison Ford, Indiana Jones movie. Did you pick up this, uh, this quest here? Yeah. Okay. Hop on. Everything good. Anyway, we've talked about a lot over the past few minutes, so my apologies about jumping around all the, all over the place. Now there is something here that we need. What is it though? Shaft of the Stars? Is that what we need here? Oh no, we need to kill this guy. Scarf. We need to kill Scarf. Welcome to Brutal Land. Hey, Crayons, Enjoy thanks for the, the follow, man. Ride. Thank you, Crayons, for the follow. While we wait for Scarf to respawn, let's go ahead and kill a Sand Pygmy or two. Okay, there we go. What do we need from these guys? Ornate Tablet Fragments. Alright, is that Mr. Dante? Hi, Dante! There he is. One of Taconia's greatest members, right there. Good guy, good guy. He's he is he is on a flying moose, by the way. That is a flying moose. <laughs> nice. Yeah, you you obtain that mount from killing the final boss of the current expansion, Archimond and the Warlords of Draenor. Nice. Uh, oh, there it is. Scarf has spawned. Here we go. Here we go. We're gonna kill Mr. Scarf, and then the Sultan Uga. Uga, Uga, Uga. Okay, loot that to get your Sultan's staff. And then on the right side of your screen, you should be, have a little button called the elaborate disc you want to click to create, to, I'm sorry, to create the Shaft of the Stars. Is that correct? Yeah. Did, did you do that? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's see, we're going to go over here. We're going to kill this guy because we want those ornate tablet fragments, baby. That's what we're here for. Hop on. I need to go put my ice cream away. That's fun. We'll, we'll, we'll pause. Uh, It'll okay. give me a chance to catch up. Not sure why you still have leftovers of it. 
that's cool. No big deal. She's gonna go put away her ice cream. Let me see what chat's up to here. Do, 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 do. Hey, Nebu Tirza. There is another Nebu Tirza sock. A couple of the greatest people in Taconia's uh, ranks here. Now, we're going to ask Callie Care when she returns a very important question. But I'm not going to. Okay, she's sitting down. We're going to go ahead and ask her this question as soon as her. Are you back? Yeah. Okay. Now, Callie Care, I have a very important question for you. Uh huh. Real quick. Hello, this is Robin. Welcome back. Crayons, glad that you're here. Zupali, been doing great, Zupali. Thanks for the thanks for the question. Thanks for being here as well. Kelly Care, here's a question for you. This is a very serious question, a very important question to yours truly, okay? Uh-huh. Now, we've known each other for a long time. I would say, what, 30 <laughs> years or so? <laughs> Approximately 30 years. About I've that, yeah. Known each other for a long time. Uh-huh. And uh, I know that, you know, we live in different cities. We don't see each other more than once, or in this year's case, twice a year. But, you know, we do text from time to time. We hang out in the, in, in the world of Azeroth. Uh -huh. You know, we, we live in a day and age to where we, we can communicate pretty often and, and commonly, should uh -huh. we desire to. I think we do a fairly good job with that. But with that being said, mm -hmm. I'm curious, how well do you actually know your little brother? Not very well. Kelly Care, you're very quiet. We don't talk much, like in depth. Kelly Care, could you tell the audience what you believe is your little brother's favorite drink? Oh, I don't know the answer to any of these questions. Is Ooh. it that? Is it that Arizona tea? Oh, could you be more specific, please? <laughs> well, I don't eat conventional foods, mm. so you know I don't know the name of the Arizona tea. Well, like, I don't remember the last time I ate tea, but nevertheless. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I don't know which one you do. I think you do the um the green tea one. The green tea one. Is that your final answer? I don't know. <laughs> Close but I know no it's cigar. something I don't like and I told you not to. What? Try. <laughs> you don't like it. Unbelievable. No, I, I wish you would Hey, do I need that? No, it's cloth. That's okay. Don't say it. I know you were about to say. Don't say it. Do not utter those words in my presence. How dare you? Don't utter what words? Exactly. Arnold Palmer is the correct answer. Arnold Palmer tea. Half lemonade. That's actually not half lemonade, but part lemonade. Oh, part it's a lemonade tea. tea one? That's right. Okay. So good. I knew there was tea in there somewhere. So good. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'm sure your viewers know a lot more about you than I oh, do. Oh, it's true. They actually, uh, listen, you know, she, she's not wrong, guys. Uh, I, I, I really do keep to myself quite a bit. I'm actually pretty quiet in the real in the real world. Yeah. Unlike what you guys are used to. I mean, with, when it comes to streaming, you kind of have to talk right. often and, and, and regularly. Otherwise, it's just... And nobody wants to listen to silence, because that's boring. <laughs> so, the point is, yes. Well, you can, you can confidently state that you now know a little bit more about, about your little brother. Okay, we'll okay, see if I remember that. Okay, let's, let's ask another question. True or false? <laughs> is my wife pregnant? Let's are everyone quiet. Let's see if she knows the answer to this one. That's a very technical question. Te uh, what do you mean technical? <laughs> it's a yes or a no. Yes. Yeah. Are you excited about becoming an aunt? I am very excited. Oh my goodness, I am. I am so excited about becoming a dad. You know, Amanda, my wife. For those of you who don't know, she is pregnant. She's 21 weeks uh, as of a couple of days ago. And she has yet to feel the little guy move. She hasn't had any, you know, internal movements that have, that have registered on her end. So she hasn't felt him kick or move or adjust or blah, blah, blah. That she knows of. You know, a lot of first-time mothers, which she is, this is our first child, they don't know how to recognize those little tiny movements around week 20. And it's not until week 24 to 26 that people uh, that other people such as myself or you, any of you guys if you were here to place your hand on my wife's belly it's not until around week 24 to 26 that we can start feeling the baby kick and she's getting really frustrated that she hasn't been able to feel it yet but I keep reminding her sweetie it's not that big of a deal because a lot of first time mothers say you know they were looking forward to feeling their child kick for the first time they were waiting and getting impatient they're like why can't I feel it yet and the moment they start felt that they, they could start to feel their baby move they then realized this sucks because he's never going to stop. Like for the next like 18 weeks or 19 weeks, 
that's all she will feel. So I keep reminding her, don't worry, sweetie, you'll be able to feel him plenty for the remainder of your pregnancy, and it will become annoying, I'm sure. <laughs> so I've don't heard it's, sweat. Uh, quite it. uncomfortable. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm sure it's exciting and wonderful for the first couple of days. And then you're like, I'm trying to sleep here. Could you please stop moving? Yeah, I'd really like my liver not to have a bruise. <laughs> <laughs> I'd really like to keep that functioning. <laughs> um, you know, it's what's also interesting is the fact that um, uh, unbeknownst to, again, first-time parents like Amanda and I, we were completely unaware, and this is this sounds... So stupid. That's not really an upgrade for you, by the way. Don't. Oh, you, I see you rolled a need on it, but don't equip it. This sounds really stupid. <laughs> I take stupid. everything to sell it. It's all good. It's all good. Make that money. This may sound really stupid to a lot of you guys out there, especially you parents out there who clearly you have more experience in this department than Amanda and I do. But my wife and I, it 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 blew our minds. Like uh like five or six weeks ago, we were at the OB. You know, the nurse was talking to us, asking us questions. And she said something about the baby was currently asleep. And my wife and I stopped and we looked at it, looked at each other. We're like, oh my god. That, that's crazy to think about the fact that our baby sleeps. Like, I, again, I know it's so weird, so, so stupid, I guess, to think about. Hey, see that, um, that little tablet on the ground over right there? Go ahead and move mm -hmm. that. Pick mm -hmm. that up. But it's true, like, I never realized that, uh, like, you know, your, your, the fetus is sleeping you know, throughout the day. And what's interesting is the more that my wife moves, the more likely it is that the baby sleeps because those those motions rock the child to sleep. But the, the stiller, the, the, you know, the, the more often that my wife lays around and rests, the more often or more likely, I should say, that the child is awake and will start moving and kicking because no longer are those motions rocking him, in this case, him to sleep. But I, n I never realized it before. Never even thought about the fact that some, you know, 14, 16, 18, 20 week year old fetus is awake and is asleep, just like we are in our lives. Are you, uh, did you get all the tablets? Yeah. You have all 10? Yeah. Okay. Let's go turn in. These all tablets. my stuff says ready for a turn in. Let's do this. Harrison Jones, hello. Okay, both quests should turn in here. That's a cloth, that's a leather. Again, I don't think that wrist is really an upgrade because it's the same amount of agility that you currently have. Just so you're aware. Be careful. Be careful. Oh, I see. Okay, so that's... All right, I'll just take that second and sell it. Okay. We're going to uh, uh, Company Harrison here. Let's see. Do you have a quest called On to Something? Yes, you do. Mm -hmm. I think mm -hmm. we, need to, we need to follow Mr. Jones here. Just so you're aware. He's back here. He hasn't moved. Oh, then talk to him and then click the option to follow him or whatever. And then it'll, it'll lead you over here to where I am. And then he'll jump down this this huge... Uh... Wee! Hope this doesn't kill me. <laughs> oh my god. Don't jump down like I did. That was dumb. I thought, <laughs> I thought the quest would like carry me in or something. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't just die. That was insane. Hop on whenever you're uh, ready. Did you get an, uh, is on to something, the quest ready for turning? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna fly down in here. That was so close. I, I had, like, half a hit point left. That was insane. Okay, great. All right, what turn in this quest, pick up the new one. Okay. We're gonna go examine. We're going to examine some things in this area over here. <laughs> Goreblade says, It's always fun listening to Brutal make a fool of himself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I do it all the time. I do it all the time. Um, apparently, there is something else here. Is this oot in a boot? I don't understand. This should all be in the dungeon. Not the dungeon, but this little area. Maybe it's not. No, why, why would it take us outside? I don't remember having to go back outside for this. Southern we might just have to half there. level. I'm losing. I'm, I'm losing what? daylight. What? No. No. That's not how these work. <laughs> Listen, it stays light until like 8 o'clock. I don't want to hear it, all right? Not where I am. I, I don't want to hear it. I'm further east than you are. I mean, by like 20 miles. Give me a break. No, it's a lot more than Where's that. This southern hieroglyphs. What do I need to examine these southern hieroglyphs? The little indicator. Wait, wait. Southern. Okay, wait. Let's Let's use our brain. Brutal. Even though the thing... Oh, you guys can't see it. On my mini-map, it says the southern hieroglyphs are where I was just located. 
But these are actually south. These hieroglyphs are south. Let's go down here. Oh, look at that. Okay, did you just have a quest automatically turn in? Yeah. Or automatically complete? Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I am smart. SMRT. Pick up this quest down here. Got it. I am so smart. Oh, wait, I have to talk. Hang on. Hang on. No problem. No problem. Okay, I'm ready now. Did you grab his spectacles, spectacles and stuff off his corpse? Click the corpse again and take his spectacles and then take the other thing too. It says lessons from the past ready for turn in. Okay, perfect, perfect. I notice that there really isn't any music where we are right now. It's weird. Pick up this quest, please. Okay. Looks like we need pieces of rope. I think from skeletons that spawn or something. Excuse me. I think that happens after we turn in this next quest, however. So go ahead and turn in the quest to Mr. Jones here. Can I help you? Can I help you? Okay, do you now see indentured protectors? Yeah. Okay. We want to suspend some starlight. I don't know what this does. Uh, okay, not, I'm, I don't remember what we're supposed to be doing here. By the light of the stars. Hope your spectacles hold the key. Let me know what you find. Okay, over here. There's something on the... something. See this like ball of light right here? Yeah. Go ahead and click that for me. See what that does. I don't know if it'll spawn anything. Okay. I collected it. Okay. So it looks like we gotta kill some and protectors now thing every once in a while. That's okay, we can kill them. That's what we're here for. We're here to we're here to throw down. Here to throw down. Looks like we need some rope too, but I do not remember where that oh oh I think the rope's from Yep, it's from these tomb robbers. See it? Remember how I said skeleton? Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm not making it up. I know what I'm talking about. I was here like six wow. I was here like five or six years ago. That's crazy. That's crazy. A long time ago. Good grief. That's crazy to me. I've been playing this game for so long. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Over over a decade. You've been playing this game for like two years now, off and on. Really? Yeah, I think we started back in 2014, if I'm not mistaken. Crazy, right? Yeah, actually. I think we started in like September 2014, so not, okay, a year and a half, but still. A year and a half. That's wild to think about. Alright, you should yeah, have... Yeah, time flies. It does. Do you have like, what, five or six pieces of, or four or five pieces of rope? Five. Ooh, me too, nice. I have two suspended starlights. Now, what is this, do I wonder? Oh, nothing, okay, fair enough. Okay, I think this is all the skeletons we need, so we don't have to intentionally spawn them anymore. Yeah, you know, Mikey said, I agree. Mikey said, said, his name is Mikey said, but he has said that no music in temples is very disrespectful. I agree. Where's the music deck now? Where's the music? That's funny. There should be music everywhere. This game's all about the music. All right, hop on real quick. We're going to go looking for some balls of light. Up, up, and away! Let me know if you see any balls of light in the general... Oh, there's one right there. I'll kill this guy while you loot the light. Loot. Looted. I am old and forgetful, Nebu. I am old and forgetful, it's true. Okay. Oh, man, I hate how this... No matter how far away they are, it looks like we always aggro one indentured protector. Yeah, because of the light. Curse you, light! Up, up, and away... Oh, there are balls of light there. There's, I'll, I'll get this one way over here. How many do you have? Three? Four? I have five of seven. Okay, I've got four out of seven. Good deal. Uh, they don't... They don't what? Um, hang on. They're killing me. I have faith in you. Don't die. Don't die! Okay, that's not... Hang on. I got you. I got you. I got you. Stupid, tormented tomb robbers. There we go. I see a ball of light over here I'll grab. There we 
go. Gotta kill this indentured protector now. No big deal. Oh, I see. Okay, you got a ball of light there. Dysentery asks, so you've been playing World of Warcraft since you were a teen? Uh, I mean, yeah, if you consider to be, you know, 18 a teen, which, you know, it has a word teen in it, so whatever. Then yes. Uh, I, I was playing EverQuest back in 1999. Transitioned to World of Warcraft in early 2005. So that would put me at, uh, yeah, right around 8, 19, 18, 19, what, you know, however old I actually was. You have all Two seven. things, ready for turning. Okay, you have all seven of the, by the light of the stars. Let me put my helmet back on, there we go. Hop on. Yeah, I've been playing WoW for a long time. I've been playing MMOs for even longer. You need something? It's kind of a big deal. Yeah. What can I say? Alright, he's going to show us what that staff of ours can do. We're just going to sit here, patiently, quietly. Sin Chow says, EverQuest for the win. Here, here. Hey, where's my <laughs> donation bar go? My donation bar just turned off. That was weird. Right, it's back, whatever. Alright, I'm taking a break for a second. I'll be back. What? What? Yeah. What? While the little video goes on. Hang on. Video? What video? <laughs> the little okay. thing. It's the things hanging in the air. All right. Well, at least you get something. That's cool. Okay, I'll be right back. I don't have any video. I think she's making it up. I think she's making it up. Uh, did it being a huge nerd come before the emos, or did the emos lead you down the path of nerd? I've been a nerd my whole life, man. I don't care. I, it's it's not something I've ever been ashamed of or worried about. I I, I love I love what I love. I love comic books and video games and Dante wants to duel me um <laughs> Dante um you know I I I just I I love nerdhood nerdum you know be geekery whatever the, the the appropriate terminology is I just I love being a nerd scapegoat absolutely man hey incinerators what's up buddy relix so good to see you man so good to see you bud you know, I met Relix for all of two seconds of BlizzCon. I, I did. I did. I certainly did. When did I make the guild static? Almost right after I started playing. Um, I think I've told the story before. I don't know if I've told the story in this series. But in 2005, when I first started playing World of Warcraft, I was, I was, around, level, I was around level 20. I don't remember exactly what it was. It's not like I've documented the experience, but I think I was around level 20. I had been leveling with a mage and a priest. Aetherax the mage, Fix the priest. I had been leveling with those two individuals. And one of them, I think it was Fix, said, Hey, why don't we start a guild? You know, we've been leveling together. We like each other's company. Why don't we start a guild? So I'm like, uh, okay, sure. I, I, had, I had managed a guild in EverQuest. And it was a little bit different in World of Warcraft, how you made a guild and how you, you know, kind of grew a guild and whatnot. And so... After a couple of days, we'd found enough people to make the guild, and Static slowly started to grow and prosper from that point on. And Static was never an amazing guild in vanilla. We, we you know, I, I was still very young, very nubile. I, I wasn't, you know, I wasn't capable of, of leading to the capacity that I eventually was able to, you know, as the expansions came. Static didn't really find its footing until TBC, really. We, we did a little bit in, in um... In vanilla, you know, we did we did your Scalamances and your Stratholms, your Zolgrubs and your Molten Cores and your Blackwing Layers and whatnot, but we were never cutting edge. We were never server first or anything. I was just a kid. I didn't know what I was doing. But, you know, by the time 2007 rolled around, I was very familiar with, familiar with World of Warcraft. I was very comfortable in my role as a guild leader, and we started off strong. In uh, the Burning Crusade, we did our Karazhan, our Gruul, our Magtheridon, led into SCC, TK, Black Temple. Man, it was, it was, I think, I think, you know, a lot of people look back on Vanilla and they think to themselves, Oh man, Vanilla World of Warcraft was the best. I wish Vanilla was still around and blah, blah, blah. But for me, as much fun as Vanilla was, for me, I didn't really come into my own. I didn't really enjoy the game to the depth that a lot of people enjoyed it until the Burning Crusade. I just uh, vanilla was fun. Vanilla was exciting. It 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 made the game what it was. But for me, 
Ready? Ready. Ready. All right. I have a. Do uh, you have a quest called "Be Prepared"? Mine says "Tipping the Balance." See, I have a quest called "Be Prepared." I think I bugged it by mistake. Give me one second. That's weird. Here, I'm gonna drop you off here. I'll be right back. Okay, I gotta fly. Oops, I gotta fly back in there and see if I can turn it back or turn it in. Cause when you like when you said I'm watching the cutscene, I didn't. I wasn't at a cutscene. Oh. Yeah. Oh, is that what that's called? Cutscene. Yeah, they're called cutscene. Oh, here he is. He, okay, I have Harrison Jones again. You need something. Did you select an item? Mhm. Mm oh, see, I didn't do that. Okay, give me one second. I took something I could sell. For the alliance. Okay, now I see the cutscene. In this, in that cutscene, did he like cut a rope or something? Or jump on a foot and then there's a rope? Whatever, we'll figure it out in a minute. I didn't watch the cutscene. Oh, okay, fair enough. No worries. I'm very tempted to go make some of that coffee that you got me. Go make it! I think I haven't had coffee today. Oh, well, sounds like you need some coffee. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> I don't think I've heard that voice. You do so many voices, I think that's the first time I've heard that one. Nah, that's, that's a staple of the channel. I like that. That's a staple. <laughs> that's nice. Okay, coffee time. Alright, see you in another 20 minutes I'll go get so. that jumbo mug that always scares everyone. Okay, you do that. Big it is. Everyone's <laughs> like, oh my god, how much coffee are you drink? <laughs> okay. Sounds good. Oh, you're very welcome, Miss Pamela. I'm happy to share that. Happy to share it. Happy to share it. Brutal, how do you get access to Overwatch beta once pre-purchased? Uh, I don't just because you pre-purchased doesn't mean you get access to the to the beta by the uh, for the record. Okay, so tipping the balance, that's what she has. Oops. I wonder if she turned in that quest. Alright. Here we go. Let me come back out here. I guess now we have to wait for Callie Kara to come back. No big deal. Just a bunch of waiting. Just a bunch of hurry up and waiting this episode. Whatever. No big deal. Convicted Soul. Hello. Absalom. Hello. Waxney. Hello. Everyone else. Hello. Thank you for being here, guys. My sister and I, we definitely appreciate you guys hanging out and having fun. Uh, has anything been asked in chat over the past couple of minutes? I don't know how Blizzard does it. If you have the game pre-purchased, you can install it. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Uh... Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about, but sure, yeah, cool. Yeah, May 3rd, there's early access open beta, that's correct, yeah. That's correct. So, um, yeah. I hope I, hope I answered your question well, or, or well enough, I should say, in regards to static and its history and my history. If you have any other questions, now's a great time to ask them, since I kind of need to fill this void with the sound of my voice. Shenanigans wants ice cream so badly, Dagnabbit Kelly Kara. <laughs> what was that brand called? Uh, tart tor I don't know. I don't, I don't remember what it was called. So, Relentless Virus. When open beta is out for Overwatch, yes, Relentless Virus. I very much. I am a huge fan of Overwatch. I've been playing the beta for the past couple of months now. I'm I'm only like level forty something. Um, I'm not as high of a level as a lot of people. Who have, uh, who have had access as long as I have. Again, I've had access since I think like February. I didn't really enjoy Overwatch for the first couple of d uh, days of playing because I, I played like a game. All eyes on me. Then a couple it's of games. Taco hey, Mookluck, thanks for the host, man. For those of you who are tuning in from Mookluck's channel, I'm waiting for my sister to get back. She went to go make some coffee, so I'm kind of filling this void just with the sound of my voice. Hope you don't mind. What was I saying? I forget what I was saying. Oh, Overwatch. But yeah, anyway, long story short, Overwatch quickly, over the course of, of a couple of days, quickly became a very enjoyable experience for me. All eyes on me. Hey, it's Thrall, Taco thanks for the time. host as well. Hey, Callie Care, welcome back. Hello. Okay, Pop I'll on. get up once it um, Pop whistles. On. No problem, no problem. Okay. I think, we, I think the quest turn is actually back down here. Okay. Okay. Should have a quest to turn into Mr. Jones right down here, true or false. Uh, no. What can I do for you? 
What do you have? I'm still working on tipping the balance. It says stay out of Harrison's way. It, is Harrison here? Yeah. Can you can you talk to him and see if there's a little um, chat option? Oh, you just disappeared. I assume there's a cutscene or something. Oh yeah, that's what it was. Okay, okay. cool. No big deal. What? So once that cutscene's over, you should be able to turn in the quest. Okay. And then it'll lead you into something. Welcome to Beardopolis. Sam, thank you for the follow. Appreciate you being here, buddy. Appreciate you being here. Mikey said, asks the question, what are you planning on playing in Legion? I will probably stick with my Hunter, just because it's it's easier to, you know, re remain with what you're used to and whatnot. So I'll probably stick with my Hunter. That's my guess. All right, you should be out in just a minute. You should see a bunch of uh, statues falling. Hey, Cooler Robin, welcome back, man. I haven't seen you in a while, buddy. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> he sure likes swinging on that rope. <laughs> that he does. <laughs> that he does. No, I'm, I don't want to kill the Alliance right now, Scape. I'd rather continue leveling. We're more than halfway to 84 now. Good lord, Dante. Dante just killed the Alliance. <laughs> <laughs> Dante just killed the... Wait a second. Dante, are you, you're not on the Arthas server. How are you... I'm confused. Well, Sam, we're glad you're here, buddy. We're glad you're here. Uh, are you going to be playing your hunter for a decade like you did with your warrior? Maybe. Relentless. We'll see. <laughs> yes, the game. I don't know if I'm going to be playing World of Warcraft for, an World of Warcraft for another decade. We'll see. I didn't expect to be playing this game for a decade to begin with. But we'll figure it out. All right, you should have a quest called After the Fall. There we go. Yes. Okay, hop on. Let's go do this. There is... Some giant thing here we need to click, correct? Yep. Okay. Oh. A little tormented tomb robber here. Gotta take care of business. There we go. Get him, Kelly Care. Get him. Get him. Here we go. Hop on. Wait, wait, you twitched. Forty dollars and quarters, Dane. Good lord, Backing man. Up. Congratulations, Dane, you're rich. Hey, Slick City, what's up, buddy? What's going on, man? What is going on? Alright, should be something to click here. Hop on whenever you're ready. Wait, where are you? Right here. There you are. Okay, moving down south. Ah, uh, something else to click right here. Another uh, head. Thank you for believing hey, in the Chris, beard. Hey, Chris, thanks for becoming a patron, man. I appreciate that. Thank you for believing in the beard, baby. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much, Chris. That is incredibly kind of you. I appreciate that. Should be the last one to click here, Callie. Hop on once everything is said and done. Yay. Roger, Dodger. Not a fan of change. I, I hope you mean, like... Like, coin change? <laughs> Greetings. Have a good one. Greetings. Have a good one. All right? Okay. Okay. Uh, Do the honors. Yep. Click the item to the right of that quest. It'll trigger and initiate another cutscene. Uh, a lot of cutscenes in this zone, as you can clearly yeah. see. A lot of cutscenes, but they're pretty cool. They went, they went all out. It's okay. You know, it's interesting. They actually said after um, after this expansion had released and people had leveled through the Oldham zone. Again, that's where we are. We're in Oldham. That's the zone. The developers of World of Warcraft realized that people, while they enjoyed cutscenes, they didn't enjoy cutscenes after every other quest. So they scaled back the cutscenes after uh, this zone and this expansion came back. Cutscenes are still widely used in World of Warcraft, but they usually are only used for like end of the zone quests or big, big quests that have meaningful impact on your character or the story. Okay, uh, quest to turn in here. Ooh, a new leather helmet for you, perhaps. See you later. Oh yeah, I don't, definitely. I don't mind them. Definitely. Yeah, I like cutscenes, but I, I can understand why it might throw a lot of people for a loop. Uh, make sure you pick up that uh, new helmet and equip that bad boy. I did. Good. Good. It's an infinite game. I don't know why you can't take two seconds to enjoy it. You know, the, the, made the, you. there are so many... Di you're absolutely right, but there are so many different ways <laughs> to play the game. As an example, like when, when, when an expansion first launches, I'm the kind of player in person... 
I, I, I need to get to the maximum level ASAP. I don't need or want cutscenes slowing me down. I don't want long, drawn-out quests. I need to get to max level ASAP because, for me, my primary purpose for this game is to raid. And when, when an expansion first launches, it's all about hitting max level, grinding out some reputations, some some maybe some in-game currency of some sort, uh, grinding out that gear, doing dungeons, getting prepped for raids. Whereas for other people... They like to take it slow. They, they like to, you know, finish an entire zone before they move on. And there's nothing wrong with any way that anyone plays the game. Make sure you turn in that quest, pick up the new one. There are there are so many ways to play the, and enjoy the game. And that's what's so awesome about okay, MMOs. Is the fact that you can do it any possible way that you can po that you can conceive of. And it's yeah, all, I'd rather again, go slow and yeah. absorb all the information. Yo, well, that's something we're definitely going to be doing. Again, I've said this a couple of times now. When War, when we get to the level 90 quest area in Warlords of Draenor, we are going to we're going to take it slow, so to speak. You turn in the quest, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We're going to go through each zone. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you the ins and outs of the zone. I love the questing experience through the level 90 to 100 area. It's just fun. Sadly, there's not a lot of good things that came out of Warlords of Draenor. You missed it. It gave me. It actually gave me a uh, parachute at that time for the whole three feet I had. <laughs> <The> three to... <laughs> feet. <laughs> <laughs> but when I'm three thousand feet in the air and you decide to drop me, it's like, no, you're gonna die. Yeah, hey, you'll be fine. No big deal. <laughs> I can't believe it. Just did a parachute for three feet. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's fantastic. That is fantastic. But yeah, there's there's so much to, to love and enjoy about this game. And, and a lot of us, a lot of the people that still play World of Warcraft have been playing for a long time. And I guess for the lack of a better word, a lot of people are jaded. You know, they're, they're, they, don't, they don't necessarily care or want to, you know, go through the motions that a new player likes to go through because we've seen it all and we've done it all. I still have an appreciation for going through those motions and... Once I hit my max level, once I hit the max level on my main character. Oh, I guess, I guess her coffee's okay. Yep, I guess the coffee's ready. She's, she's, she abandoned ship mid-sentence, ladies and gentlemen. Mid-sentence. She just gets up and just runs away. <laughs> I see how it is. I see how it is. Whatever, whatever. Good grief. Good thing I can keep doing what I'm doing, I suppose. Oh, man. For those of you that don't know what just happened, she, uh... Am I still with them? Yeah, she should get credit for this. She should. There we go. She has, um, coffee brewing or something like that. Right, I, don't, I don't know what else is in range of her. So I don't like I don't want to go back or I don't want to start killing NPCs or clicking those in those uh, statues in the ground and her not get credit for them. So we'll patiently wait for her to return. No big deal. No big deal. Uh, do, 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 do. Is Callie Care going to learn how to tank at level cap or does she have a pocket? I don't know, Drew. I, I don't know if she'll want to tank. We'll see. We'll see. Twelve more days and I will have my taco versary. That's so cool, Thrall. Tell better stories, brutal more dragons. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, Pikmin, what's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Uh, let's see here. Anything going on? Oh, she. I believe she's returning. Welcome. Oh, here she comes with her multiple cups and things. Okay, sorry. Thanks for just leaving at random, you noob! Sorry. <laughs> Mid-story! Mid-sentence! I... Gotta go! See you later! <laughs> Good grief. Sorry, I have neighbors. I can't just let that thing... Yeah, yeah, reach. whatever. Whatever. <laughs> whatever. Oh, good. Now I get to hear you yell at me on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> whatever. <laughs> there, we are quickly approaching You're level 84. a million times better at stories than I am. I'm sure it was fine. Eh, whatever. No big deal. You know, it's it's funny. I'm really not that good of a storyteller. I don't I don't I don't know what it is, but I'm never fully or truly comfortable in telling the story. I always feel like I'm like too slow or 
I don't know. It's hard You're to You're very good at it. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. I wouldn't go that far. But nevertheless, it's something that, uh, something that I've constantly worked on over the past. Hey, thanks for clicking that. I appreciate that. I didn't even see that one. Oh. I figured you had left it for me because you had clicked all the other ones. Nope, just I didn't see it somehow. <laughs> no big deal. There's that big guy. Another statue to click over here. This should be this, the last small statue we need to click. Uh, oh, 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 apparently we need to kill this guy. Okay, fair enough. No, we need one more rescued. Oh, okay. Gotcha. It's this. Gotcha. Uh, it's nothing, apparently. Oh, wow, thanks. Okay, come loot this stone of the moon from that statue. Stone of the, the stone moon. of the moon. And then hop on whenever you're ready. All right, hey, so Harry, now we're going up, for the other stone. Yep, we're going to go for the stone of the sun. Nice. Yes. Yes. Okay. Zeev wants to know if it's worth it to get back into World of Warcraft right now. Well, Zeev, if you still have a lot to do and enjoy within the game, which I'm sure you do if you quit a while ago, I would say go for it, man. You know, Legion's only a few months out. I think right now is a great time to get back into the game because it gives you a chance to find your footing, to find a class you want to invest in. Oh, thanks, Sock. Not, okay, that was quick. Oh, Sock. I thought that thing points. would take a while. Well, it normally would, but... Uh, my friend Sock came and hit it with a hammer. Oh. It kind of just fell over. Thank you, Sock Puppet. Sock Puppet! Yes! Oh my goodness. Alright, turn in your quest here, of course. Pick up the new one, the Scepter of Orisis. Orisis? Or I think we have to loot this thing now, actually. Yep, loot the Scepter from that box right by us. Oh, Nebu Tears, you hated the zone? I love the zone. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Okay, come hop on. There we go. Up, up, and away. Yeah, I'm wondering if some of the um, super long-time players, um, maybe it's taken for granted that everyone yeah. and their mother must have played this game at this point. Yeah, I think so, absolutely. <laughs> but clearly, by watching me. <laughs> <laughs> That's just some, not true. Some of us are new. <laughs> <laughs> That's and I true. like to go slow because I'm all I'm yeah. fascinated by all this stuff. It's hey. not old to me yet. Maybe you have a necklace upgrade here? Maybe? Uh, nah, kind of the same thing. You don't really need to equip it, but whatever. Can you scooch to the left, please, on, on the little hover, hover mobile? Your other left? <laughs> I can't turn in. I was too far away. Okay, thanks. You're welcome. What about... Uh, the Scepter of... Orsus? Hey, did you pick up that uh, Orsus polearm, perhaps? Is that an upgrade for you, the Orsus polearm? Um, okay, wait, that's a... 51 flex, DPS. That so, okay. Nah, it's kind of the same thing. Alright. What and you're currently using. Oh, this guy. Okay, and then... Let me see if I can equip something. No problem, you just... Keep, uh, I'm just going to take us to the next area. You feel free to look through your bags. Alright, there were minor upgrades. Minor hey, upgrades, this? minor upgrades. M remember, no intellect gear. Only ruby agility. brooch. What's a ruby brooch? It says if I click on this, it'll start a quest. So I what? guess I'll not click on it right now. Maybe that's something from, like, long ago. It's probably probably it an old it's item. from level 71. Yeah, we're level 83. <laughs> That's, I don't play this game without you. I a, only play on camera with you. Well, that's, that's very true. It's very true. All right, go ahead and turn <laughs> in this quest. Ooh, cutscene. Cutscene! Hey, Blizzarcha, what's up, buddy? We're glad you're here. We're almost level 84. We're just a couple of percents away. A couple of percentages Yay. away. And then I have to put on my tennis shoes and go run from zombies. Yeah, Amanda and I, we have to go to the gym, too, so it'll actually be a good stopping point for both of us. Zombies. Yeah. Then I have more things to do. Then I have to do real world stuff. Ugh, like I know. Go, like go grocery shopping. And we have to go grocery shopping too! <laughs> oh my goodness! It is National Sibling Day. <laughs> We're just mirroring each other here. I know. I have so much crap i got to do around the house as well. We must be related. I'm, we are related. I don't even want to <laughs> think about all the crap we got to do around the house. Hey, when do you want to yeah. play next? We did, um, we did a great job this past week. Yeah, did a great job this past week. And then my vacations and stuff are about to ruin it. Nope, nope. What? <laughs> Dang, it. Dang, it. <laughs> um, 
I think I'm free Tuesday night, but I want to say you're not. Yeah, I raid Tuesday night. Okay, that's what I thought. Yeah. Um. Okay, it's probably going to be a while then. <laughs> As in, like, a week while? Or... <laughs> <laughs> All right, come outside whenever you're ready to rock and roll. We are, after we hit level 85, we're heading to the next expansion called the Mists of Pandaria. Or Pandaria, however you want to pronounce it. Oh my god, that came out so long ago. I, I still know. haven't made it there, have I? Nope. <laughs> no, ma'am. <laughs> Not even close. I remember close when close. you got all excited about that, and that was like four years I'll ago. I'll take a slice of follow and a <laughs> pinch of donation. Steve, thanks for the donation follow, man. The way around. Yeah. We got all four quests. Let's see. Where do we want to go? Pick a number one through four. Four. Four? All right. We're going We're going deep. We're going deep. Four is a good number. We're going to go to that thanks gleam in his eye. We're one hey, step relentless. closer to making Brutal president of the what? United Taco. Hold on one second. The Potot. Hold on one second. Thank you for being you. This is my first donation. Hey, Relentless is donated for his very first time ever. Your $7 may not seem like a great deal to some people, may not seem like a big deal to some people, but I appreciate that, Relentless. The fact that you consider this channel, this community, important enough, important enough to support. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate that. That is so cool, Relentless. That is so cool. Oh, my goodness gracious. That is. Hey, it's Harrison Jones again. So we have a couple of quests to pick up from Mr. Jones here. Got it. You good? All right. Good. We need to... Look, it's my giant mug that always concerns everyone. Good lord! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Put that down! <laughs> right, we need to... I think we need to kill some officers here. For an... Oldham chest key code or something? Oh, okay. I got something that starts a quest. Did you? Yeah, actually. Okay, it should have done it automatically based on the add-ons that we use. Yes, it did. All right. Thanks for the follow. Watch out Larka, for the beard for the monster. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Marco. All right, we are slaying some troops. Brilliant. Brilliant right, indeed. You, you fly us around. I'm going to look at my calendar. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> So, let's see, let's see. That was weird. It's like he wasn't taking damage there for a second. Alright, I got cleared to work hey, out again. Hey, Work out, so, what? oh, good. So I got it, that's, I'm now filling my schedule with the yoga and everything. Hey, very important. Very yeah. important. Yeah, I have to travel, um, a, f a long ways now. Ooh, make sure you loot that corpse. Okay. And then, okay, never mind, I'm sorry, continue. No, it's okay. I can't do two things at once in this game. <laughs> Unlike real life. I'm, I'm great in real life. <laughs> yeah, so I have to travel a long way because I have to go to that special sauna now. Mm, mm, mm. And there aren't any around me that, sucks. that are reasonably priced. That sucks. Yeah, so I'm doing that many nights a week now. Wait, where'd you go? I thought you were auto following me. I was just testing. <laughs> <laughs> I was just testing. <laughs> I was just testing, that's all. That was really funny. No big deal. No <laughs> big deal. All right. Moving over testing here. Me. Oh, my goodness. D-Pack, I feel like I haven't seen you in forever, man. What's going on, buddy? Hello, Omega Barash. Welcome back. Welcome back. All right, there should be a chest right here we have to loot. Looting. Well, I can't loot it if you loot it. Oh, that's weird, yeah. Did it disappear for you? Yeah. That sucks. All right, no big deal. We'll find you another one. I didn't know it was Okay, so on, like, Monday night, I'm going to work out. That's important. And I'm then working. Tuesday night, you're not free. And Correct. then Wednesday night, I'm going to work out. Okay. And then I'm gone Thursday through Monday. That sucks. I loot this one right here. Okay, thank you. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, we're good. And then it explodes. Um... Right. Just here. So not Monday. What's happening Tuesday? Oh, I also work out Tuesday, but you're not free Tuesday. No, no, no Tuesday. And then I, I'm working out also Wednesday. And then what happens on Thursday? Well, usually it comes after Wednesday before Friday. Say so, no, I'm busy Thursday. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, I might. I have no idea where you are now. I might be able to play on the 22nd. I'm sorry, is that's like next month basically. Yeah. 
Good lord! Where, where are you going? I'm back over here. Other oh, way. Turn right around. Right. About face. Okay, there you are. Okay. There might, should, be a <laughs> here. should be a corpse here for you to loot. 20 okay. seconds? That's two weeks from now, man. Yeah. <gasps> Whatever. If I can't sleep one night... Wow, okay. Play, if I can play for like 30 minutes before attempting to 30, go to bed, I will call you. 30 minutes?! This, these are like two I, hour uh, sessions don't now. Know what to say. <laughs> I know. These are like two hour sessions. Your dreams help me calm down when I'm stressed <laughs> and cheer me up when I'm sad. Oh my goodness. Hey, Miss Pamela like and Waxney. My beard tickle and something whoa, else whoa. tinkle. Oh, Waxney, what are you doing there, buddy? What are you doing there, Waxney? No, sir, Waxney. No, sir. You not today, Waxney. Not today. Miss Pamela's donated three dollars and Waxney donated dos do dineros. <laughs> Diner dineros. <laughs> Daenerys? Hey! You know what's coming back in a couple of weeks? The Game of Thrones. Yay. The Game of... You watch Game of Thrones, don't you? Yeah. Oh my goodness, can we... And the Vikings. I need to catch up on mm. Vikings. I do not watch Vikings, but however, the main actor of the Vi Vikings... What's his name? Travis Fimble or something? Oh, yeah. He... He's doing... He's doing... I know this, actually. Oh! Oh! Please go on, then. <laughs> Donations like that make my words. beard tickle, and something <laughs> else tinkle. That he's in well. Kara, you work out so much, you make me feel fat. <laughs> That's it. That's all I know. Well, number one, you are correct. He is in the Warcraft movie. Congratulations. <laughs> also, Relentless Virus says, Kali Kara, you work out so much, you make me feel fat. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just got clear to work out again, and so... I w I've been very sick and I gained a lot of weight, and so I now I know what's wrong and I can get better, which means I can work out again. Hey, it makes you feeling better. I didn't realize you gained any weight. Thank you. That's yeah. nice of you. Yeah, I'm just telling the truth. I'm just telling the truth. Yes! All tea, all the things! <laughs> Perfect opportunity! <laughs> yeah! It's, there it is! Ah, uh, it's good to see that come back into play. <laughs> Should be a chest here for you to loot. Pick it up. <laughs> At least I get your, to hear you say you, that you're excited about the old E. <laughs> <laughs> Can you loot why, that why isn't this looting? Oh, it says is, it's is, locked. Oh, um, maybe you don't have a thing. Hold on. Six Titan devices? That stinks, man. How many? If you open your bag, can you find like a red item called a Titan device component and tell me, tell me how many you have, please? Three. Three? Okay, I have three as well. We need three more each. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh, I say. Look at you, Alt. Okay, now listen. We don't need to Alt E all the things that there's only two, alright? That's more than one. I thought it was justified. I need you to calm down. I need you to calm down. <laughs> We're looking for, uh. Wait, hey, what are you doing there, partner? Are you gonna take any damage? You're just gonna. Stay? There we go. There we go. Not enough chi. That's a joke. Not enough chi. We're looking for more chests. Not this chest, though. A different kind of chest. Oh, I hit the wrong button. That's not good. Right. I'm okay now. You okay? You sure? You good? Okay. okay. I think we have to go across the way now. All right. Oh, oh, looks like we have a quest to turn in here, correct? Oh, okay. I'm turn in that quest. He's just infinitely boxing that guy, I guess. Yep. They're just hanging out. Okay, a couple of quests to, to loot in this area. Let's go ahead and pick them up. There we go. Alright, now no, relax. Calm down. Calm down. We don't, okay, calm down! <laughs> Look, they're dead. See? Alright, you get one box, I'll get the other. Oh, there's three boxes here, actually. Cool. Go. We are almost done with today's session. As you can see, the sessions are getting a little bit longer the higher level we get. But the good thing is, when we hit level 90, they actually we can actually get like a level an hour at level 90. Now, for those of you who are like brutal, you can get level 100 in like two hours. I know. Can you I, open that? It won't. Open I can. For yeah, me. I got it. There, there is one of the coolest things about Warlords of Draenor is the fact that you can do some super quick leveling. I can, like, I can hit level one. Like, I can go from level 90 to 100 in less than two hours. Without breaking a sweat, there's uh, there's just a, a, a means to do it, a way to do it in Warlords Adrenal. You and I, however, we will not be employing that tactic because I actually want you to enjoy the uh, the leveling experience. For those Behold who are watching, the hairy, crustaceous hey, beard of love, 
Let it wash <laughs> over you. Relentless says... That relentless guy sounds <laughs> pretty handsome and cute. <laughs> relentless says that relentless guy sounds uh, sounds pretty handsome and cute. <laughs> 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 um, for those of you who are just watch, I know that you know the the, the chat and and Cali Ka camera and stuff like that cover up a lot of what you see on the left hand side of the screen. But we're not using heirlooms. We're not using experience potions. We're just doing this the old the old fashioned way. And that's just the way that we wanted to do it. That way we didn't, you know, blow past everything. We're just, we're just blowing past most things. Do you have a means to open this chest right here? Um, let's find out. I think you do. Yeah, yeah. Okay. got it. So, with that being said, since we're not using heirlooms, we're not using experience potions and blah, 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 we, uh, will be leveling, you know, normally, or at a normal rate or pace through all of WAD. And we're not going to be doing the 90-minute session like a lot of people have done. I have done that. I leveled a lot of my... like I have 16 level 100s, most of which I don't even touch or worry about because I'm not, I'm not going to keep up to date with 16 level 100s. It's stupid. I can't open that one. If yeah, we don't it. have the key to open it yet. we got to uh. go kill some more guys. Oh. <gasps> so, I'm not going to... We're not going to race through 90 to 100s when I'm blathering on about. I, mean, I think, you, how many of those little things do you have now? Five of those Titan device components? I'm pasting the wrong way. I think you have five. Six. Oh, you no. have six. Six, six. You sure? Yeah. Okay, pretty, click it. Pretty click, sure. Click, click that, uh, that icon in your bag real quick. It'll combine them. And it should complete the quest. Did it do it? It's weird. Did it do it? It wants me to put it somewhere. Where do I put it? What do you, here, hold on. Let me, let me get my sixth item, then maybe I'll understand what you're saying. Give me one second. I just need to get one more key to open and one more chest. Okie dokie. Okie dokie, artichoke. <gasps> Is that the Waxart? Hey, it's Waxart! It's our sister! <laughs> here on sibling day. It's here on sibling. Oh, we should have done a Beauties and the Beast today. Yeah, we should have. That would have made perfect sense. Yeah. Stinking manatee. I can play again later tonight. Where's Squidward? Uh, I think she's working or something. I don't know. I can play again later. I don't know. Uh, I mean, I can. I don't know if it, I don't know if it, if Amanda would want to being a school night and all, but whatever. We'll, we'll figure it out. Actually, no. We probably shouldn't even worry about it. We still have, like I said, we still have to go to the gym and grocery shopping and. Please don't overwhelm the pregnant lady. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Dag damn it! I still need one more key. This is frustrating. Just need one more key, dag damn it! Come on! <laughs> We're crying out loud. What are we doing? I don't even know what we're doing right now. Can I please have a key? They dropped like hotcakes a few minutes ago. Okay, I was just clicking my stack there to make sure I didn't have six. There it is. There it is. The speed of light. Why Oops. did I just turn into a wildebeest? I'm sorry, what? What the heck? Look at me. I didn't <laughs> click on anything. What the? Is Dante around? Did Dante put an illusion on you or something? That's weird. <laughs> a wildebeest, that's funny. If No, if you click that stack, it should... It'll remove the items from your bag, and it'll tell you you now have obtained a Titan activation device. Did you right or left click? Right. There we go. Makes a difference. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Hop on. Alright. Alright, the wildebeest is getting on. <laughs> it's a wildebeest. Alright, turn yeah, the quest. Be careful. Okay, I'm good. Uh, awakens. A titan thing. Alright, I think we have to go down here if I recall correctly. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, sure, you get a parachute. Good grief. Uh, right side of your screen uh, for the quest ignition. It stepped on me. Oh, yeah, dude. Good grief. Um, what am I doing? Actually, I think if, if, if you just kill this thing with me, I think it'll give you the item that you need, I think. Loot that guy. You should get a lens of the sun, correct? Yeah. Okay, hop on. 
The viewers have agreed that we should stream again later today. <laughs> <laughs> we are all in agreement. You should be back later. Okay, Where's I'll come thing? back later. Where is this thing? I mean, you and I, maybe we can just level again later. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Yeah, at least the two of us. Then maybe Walkstart can. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. All right. Did you click that? I yeah, it exploded. Did. Yeah, it did. Good grief. Oh, cutscene. Are you getting a cutscene? Yeah. Okay. I like them. I'm yeah, okay I, I, do them. I do too. I do too. <laughs> I do too. Bye, like Deepak. Thanks for hanging out today, man. Bye. Appreciate you. <laughs> yeah, I'll play again with you later. I'll come back all dis disheveled and everyone can make fun of me. <laughs> 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 let me text let me text Manatee and see if she's available. Did Walkstart make a comment in the comments? Uh, <laughs> a or comment the chat or comments. whatever. <laughs> uh, I don't see her having said anything in the past couple of minutes. Maybe oh, I okay. missed something though. You busy tonight? We want to level. More cutscenes. Walks art, I'm sorry, not walks art. Manatee will probably come back with some excuse about her internet being too slow still. <sighs> Sad day. Harrison wants everyone on the plane. What? Did you already pick up a new quest or something? Yeah. Oh, good grief, one! I like how you can't skip these cutscenes sometimes. Hold on there, sexy pants. You just donated. Oh my Brutal says, dang na bai <laughs> tea, dang na bai tea, dang na bai tea, dang na bai tea. Relentless. Thanks, Relentless. Relentless donated another $2, and he tried to say dag nabbit on the, uh, the Twitch alerts thing, but it came out as dang nab it instead of dag nabbit. Thanks, Relentless. <laughs> Weirdo. <laughs> Where is Walkstar? Where'd she go? Are we shooting? Oh wow, okay. Are you are you shooting things out of the sky? Uh, I'm I'm trying to. I don't really understand what I'm doing yet. This is I hate I hate the way this looks. This looks terrible. It's the way you can barely vaguely see your gun itself. Yeah. I don't think the aiming's quite right. The aiming, this is terrible. I mean, I don't think you can, I don't think you can necessarily fail this quest, but still. So if you press your one button, it'll fire bullets. Your two button, it'll fire a homing rocket or something. Just so you know. Shoot the bird! Shoot the bird! There are a lot of birds in the sky. Oh, manatee is texting me back. Oh no, that's not manatee. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I hate when that. Like I hate when you. <laughs> it's frustrating when you text someone and then you receive a, a, a text like 60 seconds later, and it's from somebody you texted a day or two ago. Finally responding. It's so weird. That's what just happened to me. It's somebody that I texted yesterday. Whoopsies. Yeah, it's just strange. Waxney, I absolutely love all the donations you give, Waxney. All of the $2 donations you give. I just, uh, I don't want my stream to be inundated by, uh, bad words is the only thing. <laughs> Trying to keep it family friendly with these leveling sessions, buddy. Family friendly. This is the longest quest ever and it's so annoying. I'm having fun. Well, that's good, I guess. That's all that matters, is make sure you're having fun. This should be the last quest we need to do before we ding 84. Should be the last one. Will the beast is down. Will the beast is down? I guess you started a little bit before me, so I'm not quite there yet. Oh, yeah, I didn't realize I had started before you. No, it's all good. It's all good. It's all, all right, good. Do I want a flight suit? No, that's intellect. Do I want... Um, okay, that's agility. I'll take a seat belt. A seat belt? <laughs> hey, congratulations, you ding a did. Yay. You ding a did. All right, Yay. cool. There you are. Yeah, we have reached level 84. Um, let's see here. Oh, look, I seven. unlocked a dungeon. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Yay. Um, 
Let me think. It is 84. It's 4 o'clock. I know you gotta go. I gotta go. Plus, this episode is already super long compared to most of our other ones. <laughs> um, let's hearth real quick. I kept eating. Let's get back to uh, the Valley of Strength in Orgmar. Okay. Hearth it up. Oh, there's another load of text there. Cool. It just rocks side to side. <laughs> <laughs> How do I get my form back? <laughs> there's a buff in the... Uh, in your buff list. It probably says like Kobold Illusion or something like that and you can right click it to remove it and then you'll go back to being a Blood Elf. That's funny. So. Was it one of your viewers that did that to me? Yeah, yeah, I think it was Sock. I think. <laughs> I think. Was it because I called him Sock Puppet? Maybe. Could have been. <laughs> it could have been the Sock Puppet comment. I don't know. <laughs> it could have been. Alright, so uh, quick recap. We're now level 84. Hooray! We'll be, we'll be leveling in the Twilight Highlands, which is the final leveling zone for the Cataclysm expansion when we return. That'll put us uh, at level 85 after all of, all of that is said and done. And then once we hit level 85, we'll be uh, poised to go into the Mists of Pandaria Yay. expansion. I'm which excited. is pr sadly probably my least favorite leveling. Oh, no. <laughs> um... I entire... thought the pandas was a good thing. <laughs> the there's a lot to love about Mr. Pandary. It's it really it really was a, an enjoyable expansion for the most part. However, I just don't really enjoy the questing as much there in compared to a lot of the other expansions. But we'll get to that when we get to that. We are so close to the Mr. Pandary. I can smell it. We will uh, we will be there soon. All right, cool. Well, Cali Care and I we both have to go out and do some grocery shopping and some exercising to some degree. Do you have any closing comments? Lovely Just thanks, sister, everyone, for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. We appreciate you being here. If you followed, thank you. If you donated, thank you. If you hosted, thank you. If you just watched, thank you. We will be back at a later date and time, maybe later tonight, for those of you who watch this live. We'll see. But, yeah. If not, then we'll be back as soon as we possibly can. Thanks for hanging out, guys. We're out of here. Bye. Bye.